News from the Supreme Court, which is expected to pronounce its judgment in the Upohar cinema fire tragedy case. Sushil and Gopal Ansal have sought an acquittal from the Supreme Court. In fact, the High Court had reduced their sentence from two years to one year, whereas the CBI and the victims of the fire tragedy have demanded that the Ansals be convicted under more stringent sections. A total of 59 people had died when a fire gutted the Upahar theatre in June of 1997. Jaskirat Singh Baba is now joining us with more details. Jaskirat, when the High Court had pronounced the punishment for the Ansal brothers, many were disappointed with the punishment meted out to them. Now, help us understand if the CBI's arguments have been any better in the Supreme Court. Uh, what we're expecting in the Supreme Court today is uh, there are cross appeals that have been filed by the Ansals seeking an acquittal in this matter. They were appeals by the CBI for a harsher punishment within the same section that they were convicted under and appealed by the victims' families who sought a modification of the section under the IBC which could get them a punishment of up to 10 years. So the arguments over here are not just that of the CBS, but also the victims' families. Uh, Katie Stosi was appearing for them pro bono. Now we have to wait and watch whether that was convincing enough and more convincing than the high court uh, 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 arguments, so to speak, uh, which would perhaps uh, help us understand whether or not they will, uh, in fact, be going back to jail. Now, the chances of an acquittal seem very, very low because both the uh, uh, trial court and the high court had at least confirmed the conviction, if not the punishment itself. So either ways, if you remove the chances of an acquittal, uh, they will be going to prison in any case because they have only spent a few months in prison. So even if the reduced sentence of one year is confirmed over here in the Supreme Court, they will have to go back to jail to complete the remainder of that sentence.